Hi there, my name is Janet. Welcome to this lesson. We are going to tackle an essay from the short story, uh, How Much Land Does One Need? Basing your answer on Leo Tolstoy's How Much Land Does One Need show how lack of contentment with what one has leads to destruction. Lack of contentment in life can lead to greed and even in some case death. Leo in the story How Much Land Does One Need reminds us that we do not need a lot in life and we should be content with what is enough. Pahom looks for money for sorry, looks for more land, yet we are told he has more than what people have. Let us look at the points of introduction. Lack of contentment can lead one to destruction as seen with Pahom. He is a farmer who owns one hundred and twenty three acres of land and pasture but he still wants more. We are told he keeps thinking of how he wants more land. When a man tells him of the land of Bashkils and how cheaply it is sold, he is strongly attracted. A second point of interpretation slip. Pahom learns from the Bashkil leader that he wants he was sorry Pahom uh, learns from the Bashkil leader that he was to walk the whole day and return before sunset, and all the land he had marked would be his for 1,000 rubles. He is unable to sleep as he thinks of the large tract of land he will get if he covers a large area. And our third point of interpretation, let us look at his walking. When Pahom starts to cover ground, he sees more fertile land further and further away and all he thinks about is how to get all the land for himself. He keeps moving towards more land and loses track of time. He is willing to even throw away what he has to get what he can see and f unfortunately never have. And our fourth point of interpretation running. Pahom removes his shirt and throws away his water bottle. He suffers because he wants to walk to more of fertile land that he can see. The more he sees, the more he runs towards it. It is almost sunset and he runs fast as he wants to beat the sunset deadline and on all the land he has marked. He is tired and his heart beats very hard. Unfortunately, he falls to the ground dead because he has lost a lot of energy. <clears throat> His servant buries him and says that all Pahom needed was six feet from his head to his heels. And our conclusion, Pahom dies because he is not satisfied with what he has. In his quest to acquire more fertile land, he misses out on time. In the end, it is greed that kills him, yet all he needed was some land. Thank you so much for watching this short essay and I hope this will help you improve on your literature. Kindly remember to like, please share this video and also subscribe to this channel.